When we usually think about SpaceX, Starship is the first thing that comes to mind. But SpaceX is more than just Starship. They've been perfecting the Falcon family of rockets for decades. Falcon 9, for example, is their most frequently launched rocket. And while it's not as large or powerful as the Starship rocket, what SpaceX has achieved with Falcon 9 recently is something truly unprecedented. In this video, we'll dive into the details of their latest milestone and how it sets a new standard in the space industry. Before we get into it, make sure to subscribe to our channel for future updates about Starship and SpaceX's other groundbreaking achievements. Launching a rocket is a complex and time-intensive process that typically requires months or even years of preparation. For example, building and assembling a rocket like the Falcon 9 can take up to 18 months, and more advanced crewed spacecraft may take as long as five years to be ready for launch. SpaceX has changed the industry's expectations by drastically reducing the time between launches. On November 26, 2024, SpaceX completed its 400th successful Falcon 9 mission. This mission carried 24 Starlink satellites into low Earth orbit, continuing the expansion of the company's global Internet service constellation. In comparison, the Soyuz rocket family from Russia holds the record as the most launched rocket in history, with over 1,900 missions since its introduction in 1966. However, the Soyuz program has spanned nearly six decades to reach this figure. By contrast, SpaceX has completed 400 Falcon 9 launches in just 14 years since its first flight in 2010. This makes Falcon 9 the most frequently launched operational rocket system today. The Falcon 9 first launched in June 2010, marking the beginning of a journey that has transformed the aerospace industry. Between 2010 and 2019, it launched 77 times, demonstrating its reliability with 75 full mission successes, one partial failure, and one total loss. This period served as a foundational phase for the rocket as SpaceX worked to improve its design and operational capabilities. The pace of launches began to increase significantly starting in 2020. From 2020 to 2022, SpaceX completed 117 Falcon 9 launches. In 2022, the rocket set a record by completing 60 missions in a single year, surpassing the Soyuz's previous record for annual launches. The year 2023 marked another leap forward, with SpaceX conducting 96 Falcon family launches, including 91 Falcon 9 and 5 Falcon Heavy rockets. By 2024, SpaceX had further ramped up its operations, aiming for an estimated 136 launches by the end of the year. This rapid increase in the number of missions showcases SpaceX's ability to scale its operations to meet growing demand. A key factor behind this success is the reusability of the Falcon 9 rocket. The ability to recover and reuse first-stage boosters has drastically reduced costs and increased the feasibility of frequent launches. SpaceX has successfully landed first-stage boosters numerous times, with the Block 5 variant achieving an exceptional success rate. This version of the Falcon 9, introduced in May 2018, includes upgrades such as enhanced engines and a more robust thermal protection system. Designed to withstand multiple launches with minimal refurbishment, the Block 5 can be reused up to 10 times, which has allowed SpaceX to shorten turnaround times between launches and reduce operational costs. The reusability achievements of the Falcon 9 include milestone landings such as the 100th successful booster landing in December 2021 and the 200th in 2023. The consistent performance of these reusable boosters has established SpaceX as a leader in reducing the barriers to space access. Additionally, the company has refined its booster reflights, ensuring reliable launches for subsequent missions. SpaceX has also focused on continuous technological improvements. The Block 5 version is a prime example of how incremental upgrades have enhanced the rocket's performance and efficiency. These innovations have supported not only commercial satellite deployments, but also scientific missions and government contracts, making Falcon 9 a versatile platform for a variety of payloads. The Falcon 9 program has faced its share of challenges, including technical anomalies and regulatory hurdles. 
Notable incidents include the CRS-7 mission failure in 2015 and a recent Starlink mission anomaly in July 2024. Each issue has been addressed through rigorous investigations and corrective actions, emphasizing SpaceX's commitment to safety and reliability. Regulatory scrutiny, particularly following anomalies, has required SpaceX to work closely with the FAA and other agencies to implement necessary changes and ensure continued success. While SpaceX continues to dominate the space industry with its groundbreaking achievements, its biggest competitor, Boeing, is under heavy criticism for the repeated failures of its Starliner program. Both SpaceX and Boeing were awarded contracts under NASA's Commercial Crew Program to develop spacecraft capable of transporting astronauts to and from the International Space Station. However, the difference in outcomes between the two companies has been staggering. SpaceX developed the Crew Dragon spacecraft, which has proven to be a reliable and cost-effective solution. For nearly half the cost of Boeing's contract, SpaceX delivered a fully operational spacecraft that has completed multiple crewed missions to the International Space Station since its first flight in 2020. In contrast, Boeing's Starliner program has faced continuous delays, technical problems, and massive financial losses, leaving NASA and the broader space industry questioning Boeing's ability to fulfill its commitments. The Starliner program has been plagued with issues from the beginning. During its first uncrewed test flight in 2019, Starliner failed to reach the International Space Station due to a software error that caused it to use excessive fuel shortly after launch. While the spacecraft safely returned to Earth, the mission was considered a failure. Investigations uncovered additional flaws in Starliner's software and testing procedures, forcing Boeing to spend significant resources on corrections. In 2021, a second uncrewed test flight was delayed several times due to valve malfunctions in the spacecraft's propulsion system. This delay further disrupted NASA's plans, leaving it entirely reliant on SpaceX's Crew Dragon for all missions to the International Space Station. The lack of redundancy has put operational pressure on NASA and highlighted the stark contrast between SpaceX's success and Boeing's struggles. The Starliner program faced another setback in 2024 during its first crewed test flight. Although the spacecraft successfully docked with the International Space Station, the mission revealed additional issues, including thruster malfunctions and helium leaks. While the astronauts aboard Starliner were not in immediate danger, the problems underscored the spacecraft's lack of reliability. The mission, which Boeing had hoped would demonstrate Starliner's readiness, instead raised more doubts about its future. One of the most notable incidents occurred when delays with Starliner left a crew of astronauts stranded on the International Space Station longer than planned. NASA had to use SpaceX's Crew Dragon to safely return the astronauts to Earth. This incident not only emphasized SpaceX's critical role in NASA's operations, but also highlighted Boeing's inability to deliver on its promises. The situation created additional logistical challenges for NASA and underscored the urgency of developing a reliable second option for transporting astronauts to the International Space Station. The financial impact of these issues on Boeing has been immense. NASA awarded Boeing $4.3 billion to develop Starliner, significantly more than the $2.6 billion given to SpaceX for Crew Dragon. Despite this higher funding, Boeing has had to absorb more than $1.8 billion in additional costs to address technical problems and delays. These financial overruns have put significant strain on the company, leading to speculation that Boeing might exit the space industry altogether. If you're interested in Musk's other companies or crazy ideas, I have a great documentary for you. Just search for Elon Musk's worst business idea, Hyperloop, and watch it. It's short, fun, and totally worth your time. That's all for today's video. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.